Pathpilot Quick Tips Robot Edition. So, we're going to talk today about jogging the machine using the interactive marker. You see here over on the jog tab, I've got this kind of glowing orb. And I can click on it and drag it. And then I can click this hold to move to marker button and the robot will move to wherever I've dragged this. If you look closely, you can see that this glowing orb has several directional arrows, and you can see that the cursor has a little icon next to it. So this icon that we're seeing allows me to move the marker in free space. But if I hover over here, I can also click, and you see now we have an icon that says it's more constrained. So then the blue marker will just move it up and down in Z. Similarly, the red arrow will just move it along one axis, right? And the green arrow, that's an example of the rotation. So I can grab this to rotate. Another nice thing that you can do with the marker is the marker operations. And that allows you to orient the marker in various ways. We can have the marker oriented so that uh, it's on top, right? This would be the end effector pointing directly down. Or I can orient it so that it's on the left side. Or on the bottom. So there's a lot you can do with that interactive marker beyond just dragging the ball around and getting the robot to move to a large position. Similar to having the, the robot move to the marker, we can easily have the robot move to a waypoint. So if you notice here over on the conversational tab, I've got a waypoints list, and I can click the home waypoint and go to waypoint, and hold to move will move the robot to the home position. So what you've seen here is an easy way visually to drag the robot's position around, target position around, and move to that position ways to constrain that motion by dragging individual arrows or rotations, ways to use marker operations to force the robot into top, bottom, side positions with respect to the work offset coordinate system, and lastly, ways to jog to waypoints. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video.